Oh, I think my camera's gone a little bit awry. Let's do that. That's better. Right, here we are again. So, here to do some more maths. And we're going to warm up our brains, just like we always do. And we're going to do it with another song. And I've not done this song before, so I hope you like it. If you can join in, that'd be great. Are you ready, Fred? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Oh, and before I forget, it's a song about a train. Okay, here we go. Are you ready, Fred? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you could help us with the actions. Choo-choo train, chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There is... How many carriages, Fred? One. One carriage added on the back. Choo-choo train, chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There is... How many? Two. Two carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There is. Let's have a look, Fred. Three. Three carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. How many, Fred? Four. Four carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. How many, Fred? Five. Five carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. Uh, how many, Fred? Six. Six carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There is seven. Seven carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There's seven. Oh, that's not seven. Eight. Eight carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There are nine. Nine carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. How many carriages is it pulling back? Count with me. There are ten. Ten carriages added on the back. Choo choo train chugging down the track. Heading home with ten carriages on its back. Choo choo train driving carefully home on the tracks. Da da da. Oh, I think you like the actions. Right, we need to take this train down now, Fred. Oh, yeah, I don't need it now. We're doing something different. Right, okay. So, I'm going to bring this a little bit closer so we can see a bit. There we go. Uh, today, we're going to be talking and learning about 10 frame. So, a 10 frame is called a 10 frame because it has 10 empty boxes. Okay. So, I'm going to just show everybody something with my yellow bricks. Oh, what are you doing? Peeping. Oh, okay. I'm going to put some bricks in the top half of my frame. Oh, okay. So, how many bricks do I have? 
come down and count them. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we've just learned that on the top half of our tenth frame, we've got five. But the bottom half is the same. So if we've got five on the bottom, we must five on the top, we must have five on the bottom. I'd already told you the answer, Fred. Okay, so that's our tens frame. All right. Now then, so I'm going to get my blue bricks now. I'm going to put some blue bricks on the bottom. Okay, now then, huh, what do you think we're going to do next, Fred? Uh, count the ball. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Then let's have a little think. We already know something. We already know that there's how many on the top, Fred? Five. We already know there's five on the top. We've worked it out. So, you could put five in your head. Yeah. And we'll count on. So, we've got to think what number comes after five. Six. Seven. <coughs> seven. Okay. Oh. So how many do we have on the top, Fred? Five. I'm going to write five. And then we added two more, didn't we? Yeah. And what did we say it was all together? Seven. Seven. So five and two equals seven. Okay. Right. I'm going to rub that out. Okay, hmm. Now then, I'm going to take those blue bricks off. Yeah. And I'm actually going to take a yellow brick off. Okay. Now, I want to know, Fred. Yeah. How many bricks have we got now? Oh, I can count them. Hold on, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Think about it. Yeah. How many, if all that was full on the top... How many would we have? Five. Because we've learnt that already. Right, but look. We've got one less. We've got one empty box on the top. Oh. You know what one less than five is because we've done all those songs, haven't we, where we've done one less? Remember the speckled frogs? Yeah. The answer's four. That's right. The answer is four. And we'll just check it. One, two, three, four. You were right, Fred. I know. Let's, we could write a number sentence, couldn't we? So, we could say, we did have five, didn't we? And then we took four, we took one away. Yeah. And we ended up with four. So, five take away one is four. Oh, yeah. I'm going to rub that out. Right, Okay. Well, this time, I'm going to put that back on, so that gives us five, but then I'm going to do that. Oh. How many have we got all together, Fred? I could count them. No, 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 no. No. Oh. How many's on the top, Fred? Five. Five. We've learnt that already. Right, so we don't need to count all of them. Look. So, and how many bricks did I add? One more. One more. Okay. So, five and one more is? Six. That's right. Let's do that as a number sentence. Five add one more is six. Oh, yeah. You are getting so good at this. Brilliant at your numbers. All right, okay. Hmm. Now then, I'm looking. Yeah. I might swap that blue brick for a yellow brick. Yeah. Now, that's still six, just because I swapped the brick colour over. It's still six. I want to know, Fred, how many more bricks will I need to add on to fill my 10 frame. Oh. Can we have blue bricks? Of course you can have blue bricks. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, 
Yeah. Two. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Four. Yeah. Okay, so we needed four more bricks to fill my tens frame. So what's the... How many have I got all together, Fred? Count them. No, 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 no. What did I say right back in the beginning? Why was it called a ten frame? Because it had ten empty squares. Well, it's got ten full squares now, so how many bricks have we got? Oh, ten. Yes, ten. I'm going to write a number sentence. So we had six yellow bricks. We added four blue bricks and we filled our ten frame. So we had ten all together. Oh, yeah. I'm going to push that back a little bit so we can talk to everybody. Oh, sit down. Oh, I'm stretching on my knees. Mrs. Jones is getting too old for sitting on her knees. Right, okay. So, this is what I want you to have a go at home. See if you could get your grown-up to make you your own ten frame and see if you could put some different toys on there and you could just have a little experiment. You could put, I don't know, four superheroes, four bits of Lego uh, and then see how many you might need to add on to finish your ten frame to get that total. Um, or you could put some uh, toys back on there and you could take some away. You could even have a go at writing some number sentences. Whew, they are going to be so busy, aren't they, Fred? Yeah. Okay. You get busy with those 10 frames and have some fun with your maths. Bye.